And welcome back to Beer Bubbles with an episode with a guest. Who is this guy? This is Mikael Dugge Engström. Uh, welcome to Beer Bubbles YouTube channel. Actually, you are a guest. True that. True. Because <laughs> we are in Gothenburg at Dugge's Brewery. Yes. And you are very welcome. Thank you very <laughs> much. <laughs> As always. <laughs> Mikael, tell us a bit about the brewery and yourself. And, uh, well, well, about the brewery and yourself. Okay, about the brewery myself. I started the brewery at 2005 in Mölndal, and we were there uh, in, I think, uh, for five, six years, seven years, something like that. Then we moved to Landvetter, just outside Gothenburg, and uh, expanded the brewery uh, a little bit. Uh, and uh, well, now we're here making a lot of different beer. Not a little bit, it's quite bigger than, than it was. I was yeah. at the old one. Yeah, and it's this quite is bigger. Massive yeah. in comparison. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it is. <laughs> what is your production right now? Uh, your, like, last year it was 870,000 liter, and I think, I think we made probably uh, 10, 20% less this year because of the pandemic and everything. Yes. Yeah. Rasmus, uh, you are really interested in that beer. I am. And you see that there are three beers in front of us. And that's because we tried these two during the podcast that we released. Well, it's going to be released at the same time as, as today. This yeah, YouTube exactly. Clip, yeah. Today. Exactly. The very nice IPAs, both of them. What is this? Uh, this is a hoppy, uh, hoppy wheat beer. Very easy drinking. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> so, so it's called Cloudy? Yeah. yeah. Uh, cloudy uh, because it is cloudy, yeah, of course. Because it is, cl is, <laughs> it is cloudy, yeah. Uh, would this be uh, considered a Hopfenweizen, you think? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. yeah. So uh, let's try it and see what we think. Cheerio. Cheers. Cheerio. Oh, that is gorgeous. It is. Very um, easy drinking. Oh, yes. And very fresh. It's, it's really hoppy as well. Yeah, but, and it's not a, d a German Weiss beer, yeast. Uh, um, so it's more like an American wheat beer. Okay, yeah. And then what kind of hops do you have in it? Uh, I have to <laughs> read. <laughs> And the label says nothing about that. Okay. <laughs> like so we'll just have to cut that out. Very, very <laughs> nice hops. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I really like this beer. It's such a refreshing drink. And it's kind of fresh as well. Yeah, we bottled it uh, yesterday. So very fresh. <laughs> yeah, very fresh. <laughs> yeah, very. <laughs> and basically, that's how you should drink these kinds of beers. The hoppy ones. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, some of the beers uh, will be better if you wait a week or something like that. But then it goes downstairs uh, immediately. It, yeah, it, it becomes kind of... Uh, I normally uh, describe it as a fresh hoppy beer is green yeah. and, and an old hoppy beer is brown. Yeah, yeah. So you can actually feel those autumny... It feels like wilted uh, leaves, basically. Mm -hmm. uh, we're not going to talk that much about that because... You'll have to check in the podcast. Uh, and uh, hey, 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 whatever you do, drink, drink better, better beer. beer.